like 4200 average, really? I'm that high after all, have all my accounts to K to Masters and end the season in Masters. And now Sombra's being played every game. And honestly, seeing that guy on the enemy team literally sit on Sombra so far the entire fucking game makes me want to just quit. Again, just take another break for a month. Like the fucking most brain dead players do the stupidest shit. Like, this Sombra is so dumb, didn't even realize I broke Translocator and still went in deep and just like, oh no, I can't click E because I don't have a Translocator. I'm dead. Hey, it's me. Your favorite content creator. God, you're so smart and original. Anything you say is like poetry to me, dude. Will you be doing YouTube content with the outlaws slash optic? Probably, yeah. If we get all the contract stuff sorted out. Um I know it was already announced. They promised me certain I mean, things. Uh like boys, to stay on there. Like I moved out to Texas and stuff, y'all guys know y'all know that. Um yeah. it's just up to them to like when we're doing the visa renewal stuff and signing the new contract that isn't a an, uh, like a player contract for the Overwatch League. As long as everything's fine, I'll be doing content with them, yeah. I'm excited for that. I'll go if I if like I get an opportunity to work there or something, so I don't have to pay for it. Then I'll probably go to SwitchCon. It's a little bit expensive. It's this very full night, nice ball spot. I've had this my entire life. From like, it's just the way uh, all my hair splits in different directions there. It just works now because I had like I bleached my hair and shit. I had to bleach it twice actually. Stop playing. No, I, I hate this game, but I'm addicted, dude. I'm addicted to the fact that it could be really good, and I'm just waiting, hoping for it to get better. And it just keeps getting worse and worse, but my love for the game isn't disappearing. Like, there's a certain, like, high I get from just having a good game of Overwatch, but the good games of Overwatch just become rarer and rarer and harder to get, and I have to invest more and more time into getting a good game of Overwatch, that it affects me mentally, like, more and more in a negative way, because the game is just so bad. But that one game, dude. Um, dude, that one game. Is it possible to get a 10 stack with pros? I can do that now. But Overwatch League players can't stack in too many groups and stuff. So, but I, I, I can do whatever I want now. I can't play Kara because I'm in Central now, so my ammo's gonna be too high. How's my current job different from full-time streamers and one or the other? Um, it's like streamers only stream, but I would do hardcore. I would do content. I would travel with Outlaws. I would go to places. I would do videos with them. Like dedicated videos i would do specific like shows for sponsors stuff like that it's really hard to explain but there's a big difference in just being the streamer and then being the content creator hopefully i'm enjoying myself i'm playing overwatch there's no way i can enjoy myself well actually that's not true i'm streaming so no I i'm not done with being a pro i just need a break from this game i'm actually going to pursue other games like now that i can play tournaments again i i might just play any possible tournament i can uh, like if I want to play Fortnite, dude, uh, maybe I'll play some Fortnite. Leave it, leave it, leave it, leave if I want to play Rob Royale, maybe I want to play some of the Call of Duty tournaments. Dead. The thing is, if I don't sign a contract that restricts me to playing specific games, I can kind of compete in whatever I want. And playing Rob Royale, when the tournaments were still like a thing and the game was completely dead because of their fucking asshat developers destroying the game from four. Uh, I know I would have won, like, I would have gotten really high or won Rum Royale tournaments, and I would have, like, done really well. But when I signed myself in a specific game, I can't compete in other games, does that make sense? And I am confident that any game I play that's a shooting game, I can be a professional level at. I just gotta put in the time. I also, like, today, like, for example, I reached out to Defran about starting a weekly talk show. That could be fun. He said no, though, unfortunately. I've been trying really hard to start something up with HTC too, but like it kind of fell through. Except for something that has been announced that we'll probably be doing. I just want to start some shit with some people that aren't restricted by like contracts. I was, dude, I, imagine a talk show where we just talk about Overwatch or whatever we want. And we just call it Dead Game. I think that would be really funny. Like you can talk about Overwatch League or like serious stuff, but the name would be Dead Game. I feel like that would be really funny, right? Thank you, Scribe. I love you. Dude, I'm sorry about not paying you for the fucking YouTube shit yet. I will, man. Guys, Scribe is one of the best people I know, period. Scribe is absolutely one of the people I trust the most in the world with anything, dude. I've never met people who, like anyone who's just like, from the core, just a great, kind person. Great, kind, understanding, and loving person. 
The only reason my YouTube still uploads, honestly, okay, because I have an insane editor and because Scribe has done so much for that. Scribe has worked so hard on my channel and anything I ask him, any help, any favor, whatever, he always just says yeah, but no question, any time. It's hard, it's, it's hard, so I didn't take people like that for granted. If you have anyone in your life like that, remember to say thank you. Scribe is one of those people. He's super fucking, super cool. Yo, right, 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 left side, right side. I have uh, talked to XC a lot about stuff. XC was supposed to move here, and I even found a venue and met, set things up so we could go and have a professional podcast in, like, a venue. Uh, like, in an uh, office, speed, like, speed, 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 podcast speed. room. Wouldn't that be sick? But then XC ended up not moving here. He debated me a few times. Can I talk about terrible this game is again? If I can so find production for, for it, uh, I will make a range, very deep, like, one. hang on, I'll show you in queue, okay? Are uh, the frame are a problem after the latest update? Dude, can they ever, one time, update this game and not break anything frame related? Like, Jesus, every single patch is always like, my performance has been feeling a lot worse. Where, why can't I see my FPS? Shift control R? That's a, thank you. I've literally turned that on once in my life, and I've never had to turn it on again after that. I got it, it's on now. Thank you guys. Well, I was trying to kill her, but she got the fucking brig. Click E on a character, give armor. Yo! I'm TCK. Thank you so much for the 16 months in a row. Welcome back. Thank you. Why am I on OP's account? Listen, you're fucking delusional if you think that you would ever see OP on Overwatch again. No way. Dekimasen, thank you so much for the Twitch Prime. You need smarts to play Doom? Uh, I completely disagree. I feel like he's one of the more brain-dead characters to get picked with. I, I think Doom is, like, dumb. I think Doomfist has really anti-fun mechanics, and he's super overwhelming and fucking boring to play against. But he's fun to play. Unless you're me. I hate playing characters that are fucking bullshit. But he's not, like, blatantly overpowered. He's just fucking stupid OP. Like, not like, oh, he dominates games entirely. It's just like, he's fucking dumb. Yeah, sorry to take a long break. I just needed a break from this game, man. I wish I had another FPS game that I could put a lot of time into and enjoy a lot that you guys would want to watch. That isn't like Overwatch, but I just feel bad streaming games that aren't Overwatch. And I don't know, I felt like the more I play this game when I'm tired of it, the more I fall, my, I feel like I lose my personality playing this game because I just don't have fun anymore and then I'm not as fun to watch. My Japanese is very, very well. No, it's not. I wish. I really want to speak Japanese. I wish I could. Thank you, though. Oh my god, I almost just fat fingered Q. Wait, chat, press 1 if you haven't seen my new keyboard that I got. It's my new keyboard, boys. It's cool, right? I like it. I like it a lot. It's a, it's from the, it's a VP3, 60%, I think it's called. My first 60%. The only thing I overlooked is like I use my arrow keys a lot to like go at the end of text lines when I type like URLs. It's not that big of a problem. Overall, I like the more space more than I dislike the fact that I don't have arrow keys. If that makes sense. The only thing I would change if I get another 60% would be the switches. I would just get different pair of switches. I got reds now. I just, I've always enjoyed blacks or browns. I just don't like the early parts of blacks and browns, so they feel really, like, really slow. I have to, like, get used to them, and my fingers get tired, so I'm a pussy-ass bitch. But other than that, blacks are probably my favorite. Arrow keys are usually used for your key. No, I know. I can do that on the VP3 too. But what I'm saying is, on a tank key list, I still have normal arrow keys, and I am just use swapping over, hitting the bottom right key on the entire keyboard for my arrow key to end URL, if that makes sense. They're not used through FN keys if, uh... You just have actual arrow keys on them, like tank key list, or like, what, you know. Have you seen like two weeks? Yeah, man, but I'm a bitch, okay? Thank you so much for the three months. It's Brandon Duh. Dude, this guy, this guy hooked me up big time. My most played character on WoW is because he gave me a copy of the game so I could get a free boost. And I leveled it. And that's the only reason I have a priest, and priest is my favorite right now. Please don't play Soldier again versus your Widow. Dude, Soldier is fucking bullshit. His AD and D looks fucking awful, and the fact that you can go into sprints seamlessly to just can't continue it, so dumb. Stupid ass character. Man, I cannot explain how relieved I feel to not be restricted by the player contract. I can play whatever game I want, whenever I want, at any hour I want, any game I want. Oh, Realm Rout Tournament? Let me play it. Fortnite Tournament? I suck. Let me play it. PUBG Tournament? Dude, I don't care. This is my first time I buy like a re even remotely custom keyboard. Ah, that probably wasn't necessary. And I only got it because I wanted more space. And then just seeing the amount of like options I have if I want to get a, a new one now. Kind of cool. I understand why some people just spend a lot of money on... Oh, 
Do I have to have a stream schedule? No. I would never sign a contract that has like a requirement for when I stream and shit. I play I play and stream because I, I have fun when I stream and I am enjoyable to watch when I am having fun. And if I got forced into doing shit I didn't want to do, I would not be enjoyable and it would be bad for you guys and it would be bad for the brands of support. <laughs> 